All right. Oh, tactical mm. stuff. All right. So it has a unique warning sound as well. It's like doom, 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 doom. Okay, right. And oh, and I can see the wait. That's a really far distance, right? Out now, okay, because there's quite a lot to go through right now. Um, so, uh, where is it? Change legend to so Loba. Her passive ability, eye for a quality, uh, eye for quality. Um, nearby epic and legendary loot can be seen through walls. The range is the same as a black market boutique. Um, obviously, then we'll go through the black market boutique. Uh, place a portable de device that allows you to teleport nearby loot into your inventory. Um, each friendly or enemy legend can take up to two items. That's really OP. Um, tactical as well. Teleport to hard to reach places or escape trouble quickly by throwing your jump drive, jump drive bracelet. Pretty good. So let's see how this works. Also tells you how far you can throw it as well. And it takes a bit of time to actually get over there. And just puts it back on. <laughs> That's gonna be good. That's gonna be really good. Wow. I think my settings have actually changed a little bit. Maybe. It feels a little bit weird. Um Oh well, I actually I don't know whether it has changed changed, I don't know. Might just, be, might just be a little bit weird. But you can also see the passive there. You can see all the, the purple and gold items. I wonder how far this actually is, like... Because it says it's the same range as the other things. And that is picking it up from others. So you can see that they're there. Now they're not. That is insane. The range on this is insane. That's like a full city or something on Kings, Kings Canyon. That's like a full city. That's shoot around on. And it's not even that annoying, honestly, because you can see the loot around through the walls, but you can clearly tell that that's like, um, that's a, that looks like a helmet, that's a body shield, there's the three weapons over there. Um, that's really cool, I like it. Um, so let's go through right now, I'm going to go through the actual patch notes, um, because, look at this. So I'm going to go through the patch notes right now, because that'll probably be way easier. So, we're going to start off at the very top. Um, so I went through the, the, um, the actual abilities, except from the ultimate, which I'm about to get in a couple settings. So I'll just wait until um, until that. So I've used the tactical, I've showed off her um, purple and uh, gold spotting kind of ability. But now we'll, we'll, uh, we'll try and use the ultimate. So here we go. Put the ultimate down. Do RT. Alright. So then we... It pings the entire area. So the same area as... Um, as what we can see all of the loot from. And you can see everything. So here we go. We've got Peacekeeper. Braver. We've got everything here. We'll have ammo. I love that. I love the fact that you can get ammo. So it tells you how many you can get as well of each of these things. And it picks up everything. You can literally have everything. Oh, I love it. It's so good. And then you can only choose two items. So even things that, like, skull piercer, hold A, and you can take it. And you see how I actually picked up a skull piercer as well? Because that thing's back in the game. And also as well, skull piercer doesn't actually go on the weapon, and you can still take it. So you see how it's got the little red cross? You can't actually take it. And see if I want some medkits, it'll take two. So it takes essentially a full stack of that thing. So essentially an inventory slot of that thing. And then, I believe you just back out and it'll give you them. Will it? Yeah, it gives you them. There's no, actually co there's no confirmation sound, I guess. Um, but you just back out and uh, it gives you them. Um, yeah, and it, it stays there, I think. It's, it just stays... Yeah, it's a bit weird, that little system, but it works. Um, so yeah, that's that. So now there's also charge towers. So in the game you'll see charge towers. I'll show you that in a bit. But that's something that's new. Um, there's quests that I'll show you in a bit. Um, the seasonal tab I've already went over. I'll do the prologue soon. Uh, Battle Pass Season 5. I mean, that, that's pretty cool. Um, rank series, I don't really care about that. But it's the exact same except now as Reconnect. Where basically, if you um, if you by any chance leave the game from like a disconnect or something, not actual manual like disconnecting, um, if that so somehow happens and you disconnect, uh, you can actually join back in the game and ranked. So that's pretty good. 
Um, uh, conditional legend chatter. This is what I really like. Um, if Revenant, for example, revives Loba, obviously Loba won't be able to say thank you because, you know, that wouldn't make sense. You know what I mean? Loba is in revenge of, of Revenant, so saying thank you to him wouldn't make sense. Um, so yeah, that is that. Also, I think the shotguns have been moved. Where, where, where are the shotguns now? Are they over here? That's really odd. That's odd that the shotguns are now over here. Hmm. Okay. I'm confused about that now. <laughs> Maybe because it's like... I don't know, that's really weird. I don't know 